I don't like the, uh, the option I did, but, you know, it'll work for the moment. I remember playing this a long while back and not making it very far. I must be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at at uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is. This is probably going to wind up being like the only time I can stream this entire month. So I'm going to have to finish my spooky game in November at some point. see a liquid trail. I'm off to a horrible start. No, oh, I guess that's liquidy. Pretty sure that's not what I was supposed to do, but it works for me. I don't think I can grab that shirt. What if there's like no, it's just a like... more tinder. Grab all the tinder. Oh, I can get the broom. Yes. Like layers of fear all over again. But I'm not as creeped out. I don't remember the game getting weird. Yes. But when I grabbed the uh, the broom, I was thinking the same thing. I was like, you know, 
If I could grab that cucumber and layers of fear, things would have been a lot better. So being in darkness makes you go insane. That kind of makes me think of uh, eternal darkness, where you slowly start losing your sanity. I mean, my dude looks like he's about to lose his shit with how, you know, fuzzy everything looks. They look like little ice cream cones crawling around the world. I don't think you can tell. I mean, there's like no HUD, so it's just, uh, kind of go fuck yourself and figure out how sane you are by yourself. I also like how it tells you you can solve puzzles to regain your sanity, but then they don't give you any puzzles to solve. Finding a puzzle is a puzzle unto itself. Can I burn the boxes? No, clearly not. commit to that. There's the handle. I'm gonna press that handle. It's like that. 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg the lever will be pressed. Anger in you. If not, I have not forgotten about horrible. it. Go to the inner sanctum. 
Find Alexander and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. See? Gotta press the lever. Please pick up milk at the store. Wait, can I run? No, I can run. Okay. I can jump. Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Bum, bum, bum. Follow the blood in a moment. It didn't let me pull off the boards. I just. I thought it could because it looked like it could. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness Fine, Josh. is a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The <laughs> professor was confident it was the tomb. You're docking my pay because I could have removed the board. To clear the way late into the dark, cold night. For Tomorrow, insubordination. I the men into the ancient structure hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British. Gonna Museum. unionize the other rapscallions. See how you like it then.
demand a living wage and more beer. Daniel Day Lewis, would that be for, uh, there will be blood? I don't know if we can light the fireplace. I'll give that a shot. 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Well, that sucks. Fireplace. Let's see. I can indeed light the fireplace. Guess I was not supposed to do that. Oh, fuck. Okay. I'm running out of tinder. And my lantern is out of oil. I guess I've been should have been more conservative with my uh, with my use of the lantern.
Yeah, I mean, if we just set everything on fire, we should just stay sane from there on out, right? Is this note really freaked them the hell out? 17th May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. realized I was supposed to be walking to the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away. Unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Yeah, I thought I would have regained some sanity after that, but everything's still just as cray cray. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble, and there's a risk everything will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Let's see if I can... That screen tearing is kind of annoying. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that hallway was open a moment ago. Fragile but not breakable by hand. Can I throw something at it? Like this bust. Ha! You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. Pretty sure we gotta press the uh, levers on those books. Is there 
already hit you, I'm so sorry. What throwing the uh, the book to break the glass, or using the bus to break the wall? There's the other book. This is the door that's probably locked. Take that oil. Oh yeah. Oh. I was not expecting that. We see, uh, you know, like videos where people build like uh, secret rooms in their house, like either under the stairs or behind a bookshelf and stuff. I always think that's so cool. But I need the space to do that kind of thing. Will help. Now the door open. very ominous music play. I gotta go this, back this way. Oh, I did not realize there was a door this way. can leave. Alright. I can't lie, it was starting to get a little creepy. Hearing things breathe, kind of hearing some footsteps. What the fuck? Clearly can't go down those stairs. Laboratorium? 
the white center. Well, I just got the key for the wine cellar, so I guess we go to the wine cellar. I wish I could turn on lights, but I am out of oil. Fucking game doesn't have to hint at that for me to know. Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left us in a blind to last us a lifetime! Or at least until tomorrow! doors are open, so I guess we'll start this way. I guess I should not have started this way. Supposing they're the order would want for me to take you. It's really not for me to proposition. Order during the time of the soldier is to kidnap and help the humans and the slaves will do so without question. Jesus. I started.
case this can hopefully help me regain some sanity. to increase my health. What is my sanity? Oh. Oh, look at that. We can tell. It is dot dot dot. That does not bode well for my sanity. Just been stockpiling. Oh. Oh, I thought that was a door earlier. It was clearly wrong. I mean, I probably don't want to turn that on after seeing a monster, but. Sanity slowly trickling away isn't making this much easier to play. It's like now I'm just as drunk as the people were in this wine cellar. I don't know if there was much else to do in there, but I think I explored all the rooms. Plus, I'm hoping maybe if I stand in some light for a little bit, I can regain some composure. As a pigment, okay. I guess it's to die shit. I guess Aqua Regia and Cooperite are the same. More pigments.
step will be the laboratorium. I wonder if I can combine all the pigments into something to kill that organic mass. I thought I had regained some composure, but... I clearly have not. Should be more coop rack. Let me see, let me see. And one part aqua fortis. Okay, chemistry pot. Right. Or permit Uncle Reggie, I think I'm missing Calamine. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution. Alright. So I need Calamine. Probably the only thing I didn't find was. Motioning the skin was very important in the 1800s. Calamine. Back to the wine cellar. Oh. 
Well, I guess no wine cellar for me. is is not going to work. are smart. Back to the wine zone. One more thingy to find before we make the next thingy.
Oh, la roba de mí. Son of a bitch. I find no calamite here. Upstairs, there was another hallway that I tried to avoid once all that red shit started appearing. Oh, no, I can't go down that way. Yeah, I'm not enough that way. And there was all sorts of shit down. Cheap. Major Dark Descent. Galloway. Yes, that's right. I'm not denying it. That's where we came from. Whatever, man. I remember you had uh, some like experts helping you out through Night Trap when you did that playthrough.
But no, but when they started responding, you were paying attention to that chat pretty well. And this is Wilhelm's room. Probably not. Josh, can I phone a friend and see if you can figure out where Calamine is? I don't want to just be wandering around the same two rooms forever.
because it has to be in, in that wine cellar somewhere. in the perimeter rooms on the right hand side because open the door behind the staircase two hundred dry the pieces of debris away starting with the Lucia Ross did I have to clear stuff out of the way of any room? You can find a chemical hiding under some rocks in the room to the left of the staircase. This is room to the left. No rush, man. My guy's sanity will just keep, you know, dropping whilst you research. Once again, the game will warn you about that thing that I don't know. Go down to the stairs and maybe try to black that thing. Trump's a little room. Also, a tender box on the shelf. Another tender box. Probably the most important item is. Aha! Alright. So let's find that jar of oil room. Not this room. Aha. You said the overturned table? Man, you gotta be shitty. Just on the fucking floor there. Okay. 
clear this shit out of the way. Serve some oil because that took way too damn long. Of a dick move just to put all the uh, all the damagey fleshy bits as you're trying to move from one to the other. Ghostbusters ectoplasm. Or high C ecto cooler. Did they stop selling it already? I thought Ecto Cooler was still like readily available on Amazon. I mean, I can't just like pour acid on it. One bummer about it was I had to do like Amazon Pantry. Ha! Ah. Um. Oh no, it's just an empty pot. And I think I bought like a case. I think there was like 12 cans of Ecto Cooler, and I wound up just giving them a lot of them away because it just it was ridiculously sweet. But the cans change color, which is kind of cool. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Yeah, I was kind of happy that, uh... Should I crouch? Um... I didn't get a chance to do the giveaway for Crystal Pepsi. So I was really happy that they wound up doing, like, a... A big batch release. So like the creatures are fucking celebrities, we're not supposed to stare at them for too long.
that door just opened, open, and I'm not happy about it's that. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Sure, what I was supposed to do when everything turned red. Come back to you in a moment. see a clog. Came from that way. Snuck into that room. was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Yeah. Sanity is slowly starting to go again.
success. Yeah, this is definitely the furthest I've ever made it into the game. But, when I was first starting to play, I would play this at like 2 o'clock in the morning in pitch darkness. This is not gonna end well. made its use apparent to me yet. I can lure this thing over here. I wish I kept that book. I know what I had to do. Yeah. 
and it did not involve no. Hello, Strong surgical. Well, that was kind of nifty. stuff in the way.
All right. Wasn't too bad. I guess that's where it wants me to go next. This looks like the zone we were in, but you know, not all fucked up. You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum at Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. This ride might be a little longer, and in the other direction. I am alive. It hasn't been as creepy as uh, as Layers of Fear was, I don't think. At least not for me. My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, has it gotten me at all? Desert, it's got a little injured, as if maimed by a lion. Like the ambiance got a little creepy for a bit, but about the expedition being attacked I haven't wanted to cry. Horrible. I haven't the needed a safety cucumber this time. Party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Maybe layers of fear helped steal myself a little bit. Or maybe intentionally it just hasn't been that bad yet, you know, by design of the game.
3rd of July, 1839. <laughs> Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. At least we would hope Glenn is. through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log. I need to go through and watch his videos because it sounds like he put himself to the ringer on Outlast. Colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, We covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the oh, mind we gotta of his men. Commend Glenn at least for putting himself through the ranks, that. And Herbert had to take some for extreme the good of the measures group. to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? I checked that already. It's funny because I was thinking of playing Outlast and after, you know, hearing about Glenn's experiences and maybe I'm kind of glad that I did not play that game. study was just going to be one room, but this is a big-ass study. Smash! Yes. enjoy that you can just like fling shit around. The power of Christ compels you. A little bit of oil left. Heliodromus showed up as a Sir, I'm 
very good refuel on there, but sounds really strange to that. Guessing eventually I'm gonna have to pick up this orb, and that's probably when shit's gonna get real. PlayStation found like he's kind of dog here. He distressed. He's very content in weeks of cosmic justice. No good can ever come when you're torturing dogs. See what you have to offer. Ah, what a mess. I should have sharpened the saw, but I can sense it. It's definitely there. Ugh. That's kind of disgusting. Take this rabbit with me. Drop rabbit. Come for the frights, stay for the dog torture. Hey man, I did not know there was animal torture involved in this game. I can use the crowbar on the elevator.
this does not look like a place I want to be with very little lantern on. Take that tinderbox. Sweet, I'm gonna blow shit up. together first. So I need more drill pieces, I guess. Officially out of oil. Did I just find more oil? Seem to do poorly every time I have to put shit together.
probably gotta be in this room, but I didn't see anything. And the only other room would have been this one. So saw What's up, Kendra? I have not. I need to find the third piece of a, of a drill. As Josh and Ben can attest, I am horrible at finding the last piece. I should say thanks for backing me up on that. There's pieces in. There's just screwdrivers. Downstairs. There's a tinder box on the shelf to your right. And another drill part on your left. Alright, so let's see. We're at the stairs. I'm starting to go a little crazy too. Pretty sure I got the drill part here. Then I got the drill part in here, which is where the crates are. Are they just called drill parts? They are just card called drill parts. Here's the chest. Which...
Teach them to zoom to your left, and to your box on the shelf. This room had nothing but tinder boxes. I think this is the room that had the note. immediately to the right. Across the door to the other one. What's funny is like, that description says another drill fart, but the first one would be in this room, which looks like we got. So this would be the one chest which we also got I'm confused because I feel like I've gotten three This would have had to have been the other room. Where I did not get the drill part, but I see no drill part.
this is the room with the note. sure this is the other one that I got. Um, there goes my lantern. So this is one. but I think even in the description I only count two drill parts. So even that I think walkthrough you sent me Josh I think only lists two unless I'm somehow glossing over one. I know, your description only shows two. No, when I try combining the two, it just tells me I need all the parts of the drill. It's just the thing I found. Shovel, shovel. Saws.
And this one says to the first room on your left where you find the first drill part. And I don't think I found or I did find that one. Straight ahead, don't you anything? Another small room offering four fortune boxes. God, this is frustrating. Yeah, I think it doesn't help that I've like thrown shit all around the rooms too. this one. So I've got like what looks like a almost like a handle and then the other is the hand crank. So I'm looking for whatever the last bit is. I found it. Oh, fuck. I don't know, a thing. It doesn't help that I don't have any lantern oil. So I'm just gonna stand in a well lit room. Someone's coming. Jesus, okay. do have a vessel.
Wish I had some oil with me. I'd like to know what it does, but it's just... Oh, there's not much. is the explosive supposed to go off? Oh, but how am I supposed to set it off? Throw a rock at it. Oh, wait. Yeah, maybe I can't throw something at it. This is not going to end well. It's really fucking dirty. I used up all of my lantern oil trying to find that last drill plug. Night, man. I'm probably gonna be heading out since I gotta drive back to Miami tomorrow. But oh shit. No, it's still there. Just 
not open any rooms while I don't have any oil. find alternatives. Because now I'm like royally fucked. Oh, well. In a good sense, at least it provided some light. of a missing rod. Christ. Alright. Oh, now we know what they look like. Just, just kill me. There we go. Alright, I think that's the best time to, uh, to stop right there. Since I got kind of royally screwed. I wound up playing a little bit more than I thought. So yeah, it's uh, sleep time for me. At least I got one good fright out of it before I uh, before I decide to call it quits. So thanks for a late night popping, Kendra. Good night, Ben, if you're still there. Yeah, you caught the only time I actually got freaked out, so... You have impeccable timing every time you catch my streams. Thank you guys for showing up. I wish I could uh, stream more in October, but uh, hopefully I can start streaming again more regularly. And I don't know how long this game is, but maybe I can try to wrap it up next time I stream. Alright guys, have a good night.